So as temperatures continue to rise, it takes longer and longer for that sea ice to come in that gives them access to their hunting grounds. And that sea ice recedes faster and faster every year. So with less time to go out to hunt, bears get less weight. Uh, we're already starting to see that the average weight crashing. of bears in the wild is decreasing. But not only are we seeing the average weight you know, is decreasing, but we're also starting to see that the average number of cubs that are coming into the den every year is also decreasing. Which makes sense when you think about how important it is that the female has, you know, a good teach people about them. In order to the I think they're going to feed them. So, for us, that's the red flag. That's the warning sign. That's how what? we know that these guys are in trouble in the near future. There's only about 20 to 25,000 polar bears on the planet. It's not very many. I think Big Green alone has a population of over 100,000 people. You know, and if you think that Pickering has over four people for every single four girls. Oh, screwed up. They're not here. Oh, it's over there. It's over there. Over there. Over there. You can see how they're walking. No, no, no. It's going here. Wait, wait. No. It's, he, yeah, he's coming down. No, it's not. <laughs> he's going back. Look at him. He didn't come, he didn't come. Help him out. So the time to act is now. Like I was saying, you know, 60% of these guys live right here in Canada. These guys live in our backyard. And they're relying on us to make better decisions so that they can have an environment to live in. You know? So please, the one thing we live in this talk is try to be cognizant of the decisions that we make every day that impact their ability to survive. You know? Turn the lights off when you leave the room. Don't crank the heat in the winter if you don't have to. Don't crank the AC in the summer if you don't have to. Plant a tree in your backyard. Carpool when you can. Any questions? Right off the bat. you. Have any questions? Yeah, how can I adopt one? Ask her. Ask him. Yeah, there are a couple of young males. Um, so they're three and five. They've still got a lot of energy. And because it's been so warm over the last week, you know, when polar bears, when it's really hot weather, they just kind of ride it out by either lounging in the water or sleeping more. You know, they're not very active. So now that we finally got a bit of a cold front coming through, it's kind of, you know, sparked their energy. <laughs> These guys, they're finally able to go out and play and they don't have to worry about overheating. I'm taking a video because I'm great. Why do you have against a small camera, you know? Yeah. You know, it's not the size of the gun, it's how you use it. I know. He likes people. Where's Alex? Come here, come. Okay, we can make our way back. I don't know if you can see them, but they're in there. Right there. No, you're not. Where's Ollie? It's over there. Look at the frogs.